This method covers the determination of the particle size distribution of expanded perlite on a volume basis. Sieves shall be standard 8 inch diameter by 2 inch high or standard metric equivalent conforming to ASTM E11. You'll need two graduated cylinders of 250 and 500 milliliter capacity and a spatula 6 to 10 inches or 150 to 250 millimeters in length. Take a sample, about 500 milliliter bulk volume, by carefully pouring the aggregate into the 500 milliliter graduated cylinder by means of a folded paper. Avoid any jarring, shaking, or other means of compaction. The sample shall be separated into a series of sizes, using such sieves as are necessary. The sieving operation shall be conducted by means of a Tyler Rotap sieve shaker, or equivalent. After five minutes in the sieve shaker, the volume of each sieve fraction shall be measured in the 250 milliliter graduated cylinder. The aggregate shall be poured loosely into the graduate without tamping or shaking. The surface is then leveled with a spatula and the volumes read within plus or minus two milliliters. The volumes of the individual sieve fractions shall be expressed as percentages of the sum of the volumes of all fractions, not original sample volume. The cumulative percentage retained on each designated sieve shall be calculated by summing the individual percentages of all fractions larger than that sieve. Report the percentages to the nearest whole number.